In this tutorial, I'm going to help you guys out set the environment variables for Windows 10. Uh, to do that, you need to go to the bottom left here and right click, go to system, go to system info, and then click on advanced system settings. You're going to see here environment variables. So what I'm trying to do is when I open CMD, I'm trying to run some Python commands. So when I type in Python, it's saying that it's not recognized as a command. And that's because I haven't tell Windows that I had installed Python and I need to set the value for where the installation folder is at. So from here, what you will do is I, I'm just going to do it for my user. And then if you don't have this variable here called path, then you will create a new one and call it path and then give it a specific value. So since I already have it, I'm just going to edit. And then going back to my folder here, I need to go to users, my name, and then app data. And if you want this folder to show, of course, you need to go to view and make sure hidden items is selected. And then I'll need to go to local programs, Python, and I need to put this folder and also this folder here because I'm putting the scripts in there. So in your case, if you had anything else that you want to add, then you will need to select the correct path. So for me, I'm just going to go ahead and go here and copy this. If I want to add a secondary variable, I just put in a semicolon. And then I'm doing scripts, so I'm just going to go ahead and copy that. Paste it. And I'll press OK. Then I'll close here. So right now I still can't use Python. So what I need to do is I need to close command prompt and then open a new window and then put in Python. And now it recognizes the Python command. And you could do this to any program. And again, the environment variables are for Windows to allow you to recognize certain programs to allow running commands in command prompt. All right, well, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, leave your comment below and please subscribe.